Hi guys, welcome back to Dust Not Included. I'm in an estate sale today. I'm very excited. There seems to be some good stuff in here from the pictures. I probably won't be able to film in here because it gets kind of chaotic at estate sales, but I'll be back to show you what I found. The sale started at nine o'clock and I showed up an hour and a half early. Look at all the cars. By the time I got up to the house and registered, I was number 40. Can you believe that? I was an hour and a half early and still number 40. There were people that camped out and got there at 4 a.m. Even though I was number 40, I was still able to score some great finds. I was talking to the guys running the estate sale and they said they had 278 people sign up for this estate sale. And they were only letting in 10 at a time. So these are just some of the items I found. Let's go through them and then I'll show you the rest. I don't even know where to start. I don't know the maker on this piece yet. I haven't been able to look it up, but I thought it was beautiful and I liked the interesting pattern that I hadn't seen before. So I'm gonna look this one up and figure out who made it. I also was able to get this beautiful opalescent bowl. It is ruffled, it is beautiful. I love the blue color and the hobnail. This great lidded milk glass jar. It is an antique. I also was able to score this beautiful perfume bottle with this great stopper. I love crackle glass. And these two pieces are just perfect. Great for the fall season. This one's also very interesting. I like the way its top is straight instead of flared. I was able to score a whole bunch of angels. There is this one, which is August. These are made by Napco. And then we have September. And March. as well as another September. This one would be from a different series by Napco. I have a gorgeous little February. And just a half of a Noel. Huh. I didn't find the other half, dang it. But I couldn't let him go. I found these great little singing choir boys for Christmas. They have flocked bottoms and some stiffened lace. This Johnson Brothers Merry Christmas tree dish. I thought this fish hook was just beautiful in brass. Check out this turkey planter. Great for Thanksgiving. I found a bunny cotton ball holder. A little Christmas girl bell with a kitty. Another little Christmas girl with a package. And these adorable mice. Little Christmas mouses. And one of my favorite pieces, this Lefton October Boy Witch. Look at him, he is fabulous.
like I told you guys, this is just some of the items I found. I'm gonna scoot you over to the other table and show you some more. But first, I just wanted to let you know a little more about the estate sale. It was jam-packed. It was a small little house packed with tons of plastic tubs and every room had tubs stacked to the ceiling against the walls. The entire basement was nothing but labeled tubs filled with wrapped items. I had to go through every room. I think I might have a picture that I'll put up here. I had to go through every room and every tub. It was a long day. Oh, I almost forgot. I also found these fantastic alabaster eggs. They are made in Italy and hand carved out of marble. They are fantastic. Look at that. I cannot wait. I might keep some of these for myself. My favorite finds are right here, guys. Look at all of this new in package vintage Christmas. I was down in the basement and there was a box labeled floral crafts. I don't know why I opened it up, but I did. And look what was inside. We have some vintage reindeer in its original packaging. Cute little snowmen. You just don't find this stuff, guys. Oh, I love the pink and teal and white pink and teal deer. Crazy. Some great crafting items or display just as the way they are. I love these belts. They have mercury glass ornaments on the inside of the bells. I love all the teal and green, pink. I found a whole bunch of little elves. Check out these guys, they are fantastic. Look at them, they're little hanging elves. They are made of rubber and I did find them on eBay, so I'll pop that up in the corner. But there's six of them, and they're great. They hang on the side of a glass or any sort of decorative bowl. They are adorable and great for display. I just love them. They're so cute, and they hang on just about anything. I also found all of these great picks for decorating. We have snowmen and I have angels. It's all in its original packaging, guys. Santa, some more snowmen. Crazy, right? Check out this great vintage spun doll head. I have a Santa star ornament ready for your crafting or just look at it. A great old box for display. I love these old card boxes. And my favorites, these deer. They are in their original packaging. They are sawdust stuffed vintage deer made in Japan. These guys are just adorable. What do you think, guys? Did I do okay? I had so much fun going to this estate sale. I hope you guys enjoyed the haul. There's just some awesome items here, and I can't believe I was able to score them. All of these great items will be coming up in an upcoming live sale. But if you saw something you liked, you can always email me at dustnotincluded and you can see if it's available.
I have a live sale every Thursday night at 6.30 Eastern with Janice. Till next time, guys, have a great day, and I'll see you soon.